All right, today's video we are going to cover uh, using Python 3.6, how to create a SQLite 3 database, create a table, and then insert some plain data into the table that you just created. It's very simple. All these uh, Python scripts will be located out on our GitHub. We'll link them in the video, uh, the description of the video. And uh, let's get started. So first off, as you can see, uh, we are going to be using the SQL Lite 3 uh, library or package. Um, I don't know how you want to call it. Uh, Sys as well. I'm uh, based on my environment variables. I am appending uh, my uh, my Sys path here. I'm kind of declaring what it is. Um, and it's two lines of code. So connection. Uh, we are going to. This will be the name of your database. So customer.db, and we're just going to run this. I am using Spider as my IDE. All right, we'll go ahead and hit uh, run. Looks like um, it is successful. I will be using uh, DB Browser uh, or SQL Lite Browser uh, to view my data. This is a really powerful program when it comes to dealing with SQL Lite. So first off, I'm going to open a database. I just built this customer database here. And as you can see, there's no tables, no indexes, no views, nothing. All right, step two. We have our create table script um, and very similar code as before. Uh, and the only difference is right here. This is where we're gonna create, uh, we're gonna build this variable or script and we'll execute that. Uh, so right here, as you can see, name of my table is carry interactions. And I'm creating my columns to the table right here. You don't need to assign a data type or anything in the uh, create table statement at this moment. So let's uh, let's run this. All right, that was successful. Let's take a look. And we're gonna um, browse data, hit refresh, and now our table is in here. There's no data as you can see. All right, table is showing up. Now let's insert some data into this table. Okay, so this is a very, there's, there's many different ways you can do this. This is, is probably the most basic uh, use because odds are you're, you're not gonna be manually typing out uh, strings. Uh, so you'll, you'll probably need to create some sort of you know, function uh, where you're iterating through a flat file or something like that. But just to basically show you uh, the approach, a simple approach of inserting data into a table, you can do this. So what we've done here is we've created a sample data set, attach it to this variable rows, and we're going to use the execute mini statement. So right here we were writing in our SQL, insert into the table, carry interactions, values. Um, we have six question marks because there are six columns in our strings uh, or our list. And then rows is what we're gonna invoke, we're gonna bring in, and then we're gonna run this. That was successful. Let's, let's hit refresh. All right, and perfect. You even got the empty string in here. So that's how simple it is to insert data into a SQLite database. Uh, I will leave a, a link to the uh, where you can download DB Browser. It is an open source software, so it's free. It's very helpful. Um, there's many, many more things you can do with DB Browser when interacting with SQLite databases. If you have any questions or comments, please leave those down below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching today's video. Have a good day.